Am Samstag, den 17. April, findet das virtuelle Musikfestival Together is Better statt. Präsentiert von der wohltätigen Jeans for Refugees Initiative des amerikanischen Künstlers Johnny Da wird eine Reihe bekannter Musiker auf drei virtuellen Bühnen auftreten und online weltweit für Festivalstimmung sorgen. Der Erlös geht an Flüchtlingsorganisationen wie Choose Love, The Worldwide Tribe oder Care for Calais. Da die im 2020 geplante Jeans for Refugees Auktionsgala aufgrund des Lockdowns nicht stattfinden konnte, entwickelte Johnny Dart Together is Better, um die Gemüter seines internationalen Publikums zu erhöhen. Musikliebhaber können sich auf Sets von Sat Mama, Ayla Schapa, Michelle Adamson und Carla Chamon erfreuen. Die Initiative Jeans for Refugees, die 2016 lanciert wurde, eine beispiellose Anzahl an Prominenten für einen guten Zweck vereint, wurde innerhalb von 18 Monaten in fünf Ländern auf dem Laufsteg präsentiert und erzielte mehr als 15 Milliarden Online-Impressions. Mehr als 130 Prominente wie Gigi Haddad, Orlando Bloom, Harry Styles, Jesse J., Scarlett Johansson, Elton John haben sich bis heute an der Initiative beteiligt und ihre Jeans gespendet um sie vom Künstler Johnny Dar handbemalen und versteigern zu lassen. Der Erlös kommt Flüchtlingen zugute. Auch im Rahmen des Music Festivals stehen der 60 handbemalte Promi Jeans zum Verkauf. And here he is Johnny Dar. Hello, welcome. Well, thank you. Thank you for having me on your channel. You look uh, pretty relaxed and but it's a big day on the 17th of April. Um, you together is better festivals and the jeans for refugees fundraiser will start. Tell me all about it. Well, you know, <laughs> we're limited in our options right now. So since mm -hmm. uh, since uh, most of our attempts to do fundraising or sell the jeans or gallery possibilities everything is shut down so yeah therefore uh we're like okay cool so let's bring everyone together online and do a festival with all of our musicians that are bored at home <laughs> <laughs> basically yeah. so yeah i mean musicians definitely suffered from this uh, pandemic so yeah and anyway so it's been It's been a really good uh, platform to bring everyone together and mm -hmm. say we're still together, uh, we're still supporting each other, we still love each other, mm -hmm. and we're still humans. Because I feel like one of the damaging things of this uh, pandemic is our identities, mm -hmm. in one way or another, has been taken away. Yeah. So yeah. I believe it's really important, and our social interaction and our need to feel human, yeah, mm -hmm. to feel like we're connected, yeah, because it's a part of our human experience. So yeah, so we're like, okay, together is better, we just bring everyone together and we celebrate our togetherness for a good cause, for the cause of helping out the refugees and to bring their voice and their message to the world. And I believe that's how we can change, you know, by changing the perspective first and then yeah money, monetary, all the monetary stuff can come on board and change our life to something better. But I believe first we have to change our state of being. Yeah. Then the, the, the lineup or the concerts will be happening on three to four different stages. Tell me about it in a hotel in London. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. the thing is, is that I'm not the one that knows all the details. Yeah, yeah, I'm that's okay. Producing it. But <laughs> I know enough that's happening in the hotel, different rooms. I can't, I can't like, we try to make it as interactive as possible. Yeah, like, kind of like. Can I yeah. say on different stages there will be different music types? Exactly, mm -hmm. there'll be different music types, different uh, artists. Mm -hmm. But it's been really difficult to kind of like finalize the setup with the hotel uh -huh. because they keep changing and the rules keep changing and everything changes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's been, uh, it's been a very challenging production. Let's talk now about Eugene's for Refugees fundraiser. How did uh, it how did how did it happen? I mean, it happened kind of like it wasn't really planned. It mm -hmm. kind of like happened out of 
needing to respond. Yeah, like mm -hmm. just kind of like I believe around that time, the media uh, coverage was just overwhelmed and overloaded with the ref the images of the refugees and the suffering of the refugees. And I believe one story touched my heart, which which was. Syrian refugees, uh, one of the yeah kids, yeah two kids drowned in the sea and then they found they they found them uh, on the beach yeah. in Turkey. Anyway, stories like this where you like feel like okay cool you know what I feel unhuman I feel like disabled not being able to do something just watching trauma mm -hmm. watching people in pain and not being able to do something. So I looked at my world and I was like what can I do and I put then I put Jeans for Refugees together and I was like okay this is this is my way of saying I'm still human and yeah, mm -hmm. we should all help each other. How did you approach all those celebrities who donated um, the jeans for you? Did you say, hey, you have a jeans for me? <laughs> to Elton John, for instance? Yeah, I mean, you know, living in, you know, like just, you know, walking in the streets in Hollywood, you just kind of like run into them and you say, hey, what's up? Uh, <laughs> the refugees need your help. No, I mean, just kind of like being in the industry and, yeah, and just kind of rubbing shoulders and knowing, yeah, and just, yeah, just kind of like, it was, that's the reason why I went for it, because I was like, okay, this is possible for me to do. I can collect these jeans. Yeah. I can collect these impossible jeans to get. <laughs> <laughs> so Together is Better Festival and, and the fundraiser Jeans for Refugees is a fundraiser. How can the people donate? I believe oh. right now, I mean, they can buy their tickets, mm -hmm. you know, for to join the um, festival online. And I'll be... Truly appreciate it, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so we can continue this work and bring in the people together and uh, changing the world step by step. But I mean, right now we need to change it a hundred steps by a hundred steps because yeah. things <laughs> things are collapsing in a funny way. But anyway, uh, so yeah, and basically we're still selling the um, we're still auctioning the jeans of, of the celebrities because mm -hmm. basically what we ended up doing we ended up going from my little circle in Hollywood to the bigger circle in the, of the world and kind of like integrating the rest of the celebrities from where, wherever counts, wherever whoever wants to be a part of this. And like making sure that the whole world is a part of it now. So went from 100 genes now to 200 genes wow. and we're just going to the new expansion of it. So the new face of it. Yeah. Johnny, where do you get the inspiration for, uh, especially in those hard times? Well, it is, that's inspiration, it's the hard times, you know? mm -hmm. so, so yeah. therefore, there's a lot of inspiration, it's everywhere, yeah. <laughs> so therefore, it's just kind of like, because I believe this is what art is, is supposed to do, yeah, mm -hmm. art is supposed to somewhat reflect the present state of where we are, and then push us to the next, you know, yeah. open a door for us to perceive a next possibility of what is possible, you know? So, yeah, right now, in these days, when every when everything slows down, you know, this is when you start realizing that your body hurts, you know? This is when you start realizing that maybe I should start, maybe I should change my walk, you know? Mm -hmm. So, in a lot of ways, this has been working out for us because I've been focusing on the future. I've not been focusing on looking at anything that's happening at the moment. <laughs> so therefore I find myself right now in a good place because people are attracted to what I'm doing because it opens you up to a new perspective, a positive uh, world, you know, <laughs> to be in, away from this negativity. So we hope uh, for you the best for Together is Better Festival and we hope lots of people will see it. It's at 7 o'clock p.m. Yeah. London yeah, time. Five hours long. Yeah. It's a, you know, we, we, you know it's not a three-day festival. It's a five-hour. It's, it's a five-hour. Five exactly. <laughs> but I think it's worth it. And thank you for being here in Berlin here shortly. Yay. Thank you so much for now, having me. Again. I wish you all the best. Das Music Festival Together is Better findet am 17. April um 19 Uhr britische Sommerzeit statt. Tickets gibt es ab 5 Pounds. Beim Kauf können Benutzer individuell auswählen, wie viel sie darüber hinaus spenden wollen. Weitere Informationen unter togetherisbetterfestival.com